Hi guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be on this makeup look right here and I hope you guys like it and let's just get into the video. The first thing I'm going to be doing is taking my Lorac eyeshadow primer and just putting that all over my eyelids. And I didn't show my eyebrows on camera but I did use the Anastasia pomade in taupe and just did my eyebrows but they're the same in every video so I figured I just didn't have to show them and then I'm just gonna be concealing my eyelids because I do have veiny eyelids and I wanted to cover them up next I'm going to be taking my morphe 35 palette and I'm going to be setting the concealer with this tan shade and then taking this orange shade, I'm going to be putting this in my crease to just kind of blow out this look. And I'm going to be applying this everywhere. Next, I'm going to be taking this deeper orange and putting that in the outer corners. Then I'm going to be taking this palette from Shan XO from BH Cosmetics and I'm going to be putting that color in my outer corners. Then I'm going to be taking my Inglot liquid eyeshadow and this is a beautiful blue and I'm just going to be putting this on my eyelid. <laughs> I'm just going to be blending this out with a Morphe buffing brush and then I'm going to be taking that deeper color in the Shan XO palette and just putting that in my outer corners to blend everything out. Then I'm just going to be repeating those steps just so everything is to my liking and blending everything out. And then I'm going to be taking my, of course, Jessie's Girl eyeliner and just winging that out and yeah. After this, I'm going to be taking this white shade in my MAC palette and just putting that under my brow bone to highlight a little bit. And then I'm going to be taking my Ardell Wispies and putting that on my eyelashes. Then for the face, I'm doing my Nivea Men's Post Shave Balm and putting that all over my face with the Stippling Brush by Morphe. And then applying my Mary Kay foundation. This foundation was the only one that matched my fake tan, so that's what we're going to work with today. It is a little bit dark, but once I blend everything out, it matches perfectly to my tan. And I know the difference is a lot, but it matched my neck, so that's all that matters. Now I'm going to be taking my Age Rewind Maybelline Concealer and just putting that under my eyes, on my nose, um, my upper lip, and my chin and my forehead just to brighten my face up a little bit. And then after this, yep, you guessed it, my RCMA No Color Powder once again. Um, I love this stuff. It is not comparable to anything that I have, so yeah, I'm going to keep using it. Then 
taking that bronzer in my MAC palette, I am going to be bronzing up my face. And since the MAC palette was made by me, I don't have the names of everything. So I will link the names in the description box if you are curious. Then taking my new favorite, this is the Morphe blush palette. I am going to be taking this peachy pink shade and putting that on my cheeks. And my BH Cosmetics Nude Rose Highlighter. I am going to be taking this gold champagne -y color and highlighting my face with that. And for underneath my eye, I'm just going to be taking some of that blue shade and putting that under my eye. Then I'm going to be taking that orangey color again and just blending everything out so it's not like harsh lines. And for my inner corners, I'm going to be taking this Shan XO color in a light champagne and just highlighting my inner corners and then I'm going to be taking my Tarte lip gloss and this is just a really pretty nude shade and I thought it went really well with the look and yeah and I'm going to be taking my telescopic mascara by L'Oreal and just doing my bottom lashes and lastly I'm going to be spraying my face with the wet n wild setting spray and yeah this completes this look i hope you guys liked it i'm in love with this look i think it is so pretty and so unique and i hope you guys liked it as well please make sure to thumbs up and subscribe down below and click the little bell so you know when i post a video and yeah i will see you guys in my next video bye guys